Hello. Hello, 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 hello. Come and join us, everybody. It's been a while since I've been on here. I'm going to try to do my best to answer all the questions and give you as much information as possible. Um, thank you, everybody, for joining us tonight. Joining me tonight, Bella Sloan Enterprises. Hello, 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 everybody. Hello, Organic Girl 35, Cindy, the real estate agent. Tiff, hello, everybody. Thank you for joining me this evening for our live today. Um, what's up, Tess? Wow, you guys got on here really fast. Hey, T, T-Bone. T-Bone sent me. Um, hello, Karen. Hello, everybody. Come and join us today. We're going to get right to it. What's up, King? Um, any questions you have, I want you to start dropping them so I can get ready. What's up, Jessica Madeline? I heart credit, my favorite girl in the whole wide world, Queen Ray 14. How are you guys doing today? Listen, so I got a couple of announcements I want to get to. Y'all see my um quarantine beard? I'm telling you, y'all saw me post it earlier. I'm I promise you, I will be opening up a nail salon, a hair salon. I'm I'm it's gotta happen. It's gotta happen. Um, what's up, motivator? How are everybody doing today? Thank you for joining me today. So listen, um, we've been quarantined, right? But there's a lot of information I still want to get out to everybody. My phones have been going crazy. And my staff, Damaris and Jasmine, they're like, can you get on live? There's Damaris right there. And answer some questions, please. Um, once you get our credits fixed, what is next? Get some business credit. That's what's next. And get some investing. Um, and we're going to talk about that. Listen, I got one quick announcement for everybody, right? So the Blueprint Summit that I was supposed to have on April 11th, right? Put my deposit at Temple and everything. Got the caterers together and everything. And they sent me an email and got me out of here. So we're going to be doing that virtual real soon. When I apply for Amex Business Line, how do I apply without using my social? Because it won't let me continue unless I enter it. So with business credit, guys, you have to remember um, it is personally guaranteed. So especially for Amex, let me tell you how you get a, a, a business credit card that's not connected to your personal with Amex. Your business needs to be two years old. Your business credit score, which is your paydex score, it needs to be 90 and above. Um, and you need to have 15 trade lines reporting to your business credit report and your business needs to make two to $3 million a year. That's how you do that. And you have to call and apply for that. You can't apply for that online. Okay. So that's how you get business credit through Amex. Okay. Um, my question is, do you offer services in which you teach people how to teach people how to fix their credit? Yes. It's being worked on right now. All that stuff is going to be launched. I actually posted, uh, that, that, that yesterday. Um, what banks do you recommend to bank with? Credit unions first. Those are the best banks to get business credit first, especially now. All right. Go to your your um your credit unions first. Open up a business checking account. Get a relationship with them and then open up uh, and then ask for a business credit card. All right. That's how you do it. That's how you get business credit. Start with the smaller banks first. That's super crucial. What business credit cards do you like? I like credit unions. I like Amex and I like Chase. OK, that's who I like. Um, is all business credit PG until your business is two years old? No, all business is not PG. It doesn't necessarily matter how, how old your business is. When your business becomes two years old, 15 trade lines, your paid export needs to be 90, and you need to make 2 to $3 million a year. Do I have a mentorship program? That is coming this summer. I'm working on all of that. So real quick, right? Hold on to your questions real quick. Let me tell you about a couple of announcements that I have because I, I did post it the other day and people had a lot of um, question. all right? Yes, Johnson, hit me up later tomorrow. Um, Navy Federal is a great one. That's a great personal credit card and a business credit card to get. All right. Super great. If somebody could get you into Navy Federal, get into that. So primary trade lines. I'm working on a program right now. Um, it's being tested out. You know, I don't like to give anything out to anybody unless I know it works and it's been vetted where primary trade lines can be reported that are aged to your personal credit report, which get, will help you guys with business funding. Um, and and personal funding. Somebody said Navy Federal is not opening new accounts right now. Um, that's unfortunate, but definitely bookmark them. All right. So those primary trade lines are being tested right now. Definitely going to be offering them to the people. So there's a lot of people who got their credit fixed and they got to wait a year or two before they could get business credit. Yes. Prime real estate. This is going to be very big in regards to helping people get funding. Um, I just refined my car with them. Because of PPP. Yes, the PPP program, Paycheck Protection Program. If you are trying to get business lines of credit, right, that business has slowed down significantly because until that PPP money runs out, the banks are focusing 
on that funding and not giving business lines of credit. Business credit cards are still like this. You see me posting those results every day because computers are doing that, okay? When, um, when open up a business account, what type of consultant business do you tell them? I tell them I'm a business consultant. That's it. Don't make it too complicated. I have three clients with open accounts on Navy Federal on Monday. I Heart Credit said, um, so I'm getting mixed reviews on Navy Fed. Um, I received a credit card from Navy Federal two weeks ago. Call Navy Federal, guys. Call them. Don't listen to people. Find out yourself. Number two, HLLCs. Yes, people have been asking me about this all the time. So whatever products my, my team, my clients, people are asking me about, I'm like, let me help these guys find this so I can find reputable dealers. So I do have a business in a box program, right? Where we get you to age LLC. This is if you have good credit, 680 and above, right? We get you to age LLC, right? We get you um, a cash flowing property immediately, right? Um, the moment you sign the paperwork and you can take out a little money and you get um, 30 year mortgage on it immediately. So that's a great program. If you need more information on that business in a box program where we give you the age LLC, the LLC is done already. We hand that over to you, sign it over to you. Then we help you get funding for that LLC. And then you use that to purchase real estate investments. Three step. If you got the good credit, this is super important. We can help you with that. Hammer. How many primary trade lines should I have before qualifying for business funding? I have a total of 4,000 on my credit report waiting on New Coastal Direct. All right. Do I still do the one? The one on one is has stopped because I can't see anybody right now. I can't do the one on ones and we can't walk into the bank anymore. So we have to stop on that. Let me tell you about my, my business credit program. Do you already do you already got to know what your business plan is to? No, no, no. But business plans are not necessary in order to get business credit. OK, um, so 680 credit score. That's minimum what you need. Right. Um, the cost of the business in a box program depends. So if you want information on business in a box, um, Email me, info at bellasoneenterprises.com. I'll send you the video that has all the information about it. Now, um, 680 credit score and above, that gets you into the room, right? Next question is, Herman, how much can your company get me? And I'm going to show you how to get it on your own. I'm going to show you how we do it, and I'm going to show you how to get it on your own. So stay tuned. Um, 680 business credit score, right? A personal credit score. You um, That gets you into the room. Next question is, Herman, how much money can I get? What we do is we multiply your strongest personal credit card by five and we get you that amount in business credit. So if you had a $5,000 credit card, two years old, that means we can get you between 25 and 30,000 in business credit, 0% interest for up to a year. Somebody just dropped my email down there. Please take it down, right? Um, so we're basically rewarding you for having good credit. Right. The older your credit, personal credit cards, the higher your limits, the more money you can get in business funding. Now, a lot of people have gotten really smart and have gotten um, credit partners to help them get business credit. So your mom, cousin, friend, be like, yo, it's co-sign for my business. The money comes in your business name, so it's yours to control. Right. That's the benefit of it. But the, the credit debt doesn't show up on your partner's credit report. All right. That's 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 how people are getting backing into business credit if you don't have it. All right. So. That's one thing. Next thing, age LLCs, we talked about that. Fifty to hundred thousand dollar lines of credit. There's something else that I put in my story the other day. These are things that are coming soon this year. This is what I've been working on since they shut us down, right? I've been working on all these things. So fifty to hundred thousand dollar line of credit. Again, everybody, everything starts with good credit. Okay. So um, if you have a 700 credit score and you have two-year-old business and you have one credit card that's over ten thousand dollars. I have a team that can get you between fifty and hundred thousand dollars in business credit. Okay, so that's how that program works. Next up, turnkey investment properties that are cash flowing at business. That's something else that I posted. That's the business in the box um, program. All right. Um, what about twenty five thousand dollar trade line? Can I get about one hundred twenty five? Yes. So my clients, I posted a couple of times when my clients are getting like six figures in business credit. That's because they have like, ironically, they have Navy Federal. They have like a couple of Navy Federal cards that are 15, 20 grand, right? They got like one or two of them and they're getting up to almost six figures in business credit. OK, um, we look at cards that are over two years old. Anything under two years old, we can't help with. All right. But I'm going to show you how to get business credit on your own outside of my program. All right, guys, I wrote three ebooks that I'm going to be giving out for free. That's going to educate everybody on how to get business credit on their own. I'm going to make it available on my website. My team is tweaking it right now. The Blueprint Summit, again, is coming back live. This thing is going to be epic, guys. It's going to be epic. I forget the Zoom, all that stuff. It's going to be a production. I'm going to give you a link. We're going to give you much game. I'm going to be on there for four hours giving you game. Slow down. My pen don't move that fast. I got you. 
but definitely email me if you have any questions because this thing be shutting me down in an hour and I hate not being able to give all the game out. Okay, but I'm going to slow down and come back to it. I just want to get through this announcement. I'm going to show everybody at my Blueprint Summit, I'm going to show you how to get the cash off the credit cards because Herman, I ain't got access to business lines of credit yet, right? So I can't move the money from the account to, to, the, to the line, to the checking account. I just got business credit cards. I'm going to show you how to take the cash off the cards. All right. That's super major. That's what a lot of my people, my clients who came to me, they get the cash off the cards and they're investing in real estate. Listen, guys, I want to stop right here real quick, real quick. Listen to me. Listen to me. Everybody's in a different place. So this message isn't for everybody. OK, I know a lot of people are struggling right now. It's hurting right now. If you ain't got food and shelter, you're not really thinking about business, business credit, none of that nonsense. And it's cool. Focus on home and staying safe first. Right. But to everybody else. Remember when everybody was complaining, I ain't got time to do this, this, and this, and this? We have been locked up for almost three months now. What have you got accomplished? I have people that signed up with me in January. They, they've just about done. So they're about to hit go. So your success started three, three months ago, 90 days ago, 120 days ago. So the game that I'm giving, that I'm about to drop on you about this business credit, fixing your credit, you got to take notes. You got to utilize this information, guys, because you see they're changing everything right now under our noses. No one is going to save you. $1,200 was a joke and it was an insult. All right. I have a trade line business where one of my cards made me $1,200 in like three days. I want to give you guys that game to be able to do that. No one's coming to save us, especially us. That that um SBA money, that PPP money, I'm going to drop some game on about that, about how, how only 1% of black businesses got that money, right? No one's coming to save us. So let's let's educate ourselves so we can do a lot better. Um, Can we still pay for the Blueprint Seminar? No, I'm going to set all that up. I'm going to set new dates up. I'm going to get a studio, um, invite my people to come in and that we're going to teach a class um, virtually. So I just want to put the buzz out there that it's coming and we're going to we're going to drop everything at you and it's not going to be a ridiculous amount of money. I don't I don't make money off of seminars, right? I make money off of getting clients. So I'm not going to charge you out the butt and make it crazy, okay? Um how to get the cash off the cards. We're going to um show you this is some new game, right? Cuz cuz I want to get you ready for when you do make the million dollars, all right? How to hide ownership of the LLCs, right? So you got a couple of LLCs. I got Bella Sloan here. I got Olivia Monroe here. I got a couple of LLCs, whatever LLCs y'all got, right? You know what the other side is doing? They put the LLCs under another business and nobody knows who owns that business. And that business controls all the LLCs. I'm going to show you how to hide that, okay? Um, so that protects your assets because people love suing people. So I'm going to show you how to do that. That's some great game Kevin, Kevin Dalsey is going to show you how to do. I'm going to show you how to start your own credit repair business. That's not going to be at the Blueprint Summit. That's another class. We're going to sit down, um, me and Derek, CEO, um, we're going to be sitting down. Yes, a holding company. Derek, CEO, we're going to be sitting down and we're going to be teaching people how to start their own business. I mean, credit repair company from suits to nuts. The mistakes that we've made, we're going to be sitting down. We're going to be showing you guys how to do that. That's a separate class. All right. Everybody has been begging for it. We're going to show you how to do it. You have to fly into Philly to do that. I'm not doing that class virtually. All right. Um, how to start your own trade line business. Right. I just showed you how just on my personal credit cards, I'm making money. If you got good credit, I'm going to show you guys how to do it, too. If you don't got your own credit cards, I'm going to show you how to get the same access to the lines of credit I have. I'm going to be giving that same access to you so you can start your own trade line business. You can have your own hustle. All right. So when the world shut down, it's not one stream of income. Listen, guys, having a job is dangerous. Having a job is dangerous because you only have one stream of income. That is dangerous, all right? No, you need to have multiple streams of income, okay? I have the trade line business, credit repair, business credit, my real estate investments, right? Something always coming in, right? Nickel and, and then I stay under my, um, my, uh, my means. People laugh at me all the time. You still driving that Honda CRV? Yes, until it dies. Probably like this, y'all, I'm gonna get something nice to flex, but you know right now I'm gonna chill, okay? Um, I don't have business credit. Do you help with starting any type of business in order to qualify? Yes. Yeah, so my brother, Kevin J dot D O L C E Kevin J dot D O L C E. He helps you start up your LLCs. All right. Is investing in properties right now. A good idea. Um, I think it's still a good idea. If the numbers make sense. Absolutely. I'm still investing in real estate right now. 
I'm, I'm going to drop the stuff I'm, I'm doing. Once I buy some stuff, I'm definitely going to show you what I'm doing. And then Bella Sloan Academy. That's the last thing that I'm doing. Bella Sloan Academy. I'm starting up an academy, right? So website, ev I'm listen, everything I have, I'm going to drop on that website, right? And I'm going to update it all the time, right? It's a website that I'm building right now. Kevin is my brother. Kevin J. Dolce. He helps you write business plans and he helps you with your LLC, your EIN, and your operating agreement. He does many other things. He's working on trademarks and all that other stuff. All right, let's get back to the questions. Herman, what are the other qualifications needed for the 680 program? All right, um, your business, I don't care how old your business is. You got an LLC, get it, all right? 680 credit score, no collections, no charge off, no bankruptcies, no late payments in two years. We ha we multiply your strongest personal credit card by two. Not your, not your highest credit card limit, your strongest. So whichever one is over two years old, $2,500 limit, that's what we're looking at. Make sure you don't run your credit a bunch of time. D-O-L-C-E. Kevin J dot D-O-L-C-E. What's the email for the business plan? Kevin J dot D as in David O-L-C-E. Go to his Instagram page. All right. <clears throat> Currently in the middle of buying my first property. We're getting business credit now. Mess me up. Um, wait till you buy your property because like you, when you're buying real estate or your first house, they always tell you don't run your credit. All right. So you want to, you want to wait. Closed accounts will not hurt you. Can we get those removed? How long will it take for inquiry removal? I paid you 80. Wanted to know how long will it take? It takes 45 days with my inquiry program. We charge $40 per inquiry and it takes up to 45 days. If I don't get it done in 45 days, I give you your money back and we still work on it. Nobody else is doing that. All right. We are results based business. All right. Uh, we give Dunn's number to get your Dunn's number. Just Google D U N S. Um, and then you go to Dunn and Bradstreet's website and they show you how to, and they give you a Dunn's number. You're going to need that, need that long term in regards to building your business credit. Yes, 45 days or I give you your money back. All right. No, I do not do payment plans. I do not. We got, I got to pay my team up front to get the work done. How old does my business need to be before I can approve for credit? I don't care how old your business is. Um, I got my LLC and got denied by Bank of America, and I have well over six, uh, well over eight twenty FICO. Um, a Trini gal, I need you to DM me. It's probably because your credit profile is too thin. Oh, let's talk about that. Let me tell you how to get business credit on your own. All right. I know there's some questions coming in. Can you remove thirty day late payments? If the account is closed, we can help dispute. Okay. If it's open, I can't help dispute it. Can we establish relationships with new banks like key banks if they are closed? Um, yes, I, I think you can. You have to call these banks. Hey, can I come in? Like even with my bank, I need to make an appointment before I can go in there. I tell them what I need and then you can go in there or they'll take your information over the phones. But the banks are still running, guys. You can still walk in there and get business credit. Here's how you get business credit outside of my company. Herman, I don't want to pay you. Herman, I don't want to work with you. Well, let me give you some game on how you do it. Um, how many business bank accounts should you have? I have seven. Seven, seven business bank accounts. Don't keep your money in one place. All right. I work with people nationwide. All right. Um, I'm a mo I'm a I'm an internet based business. So I work with everybody everywhere. All right. My man just got thirty five thousand dollars in funding. Congratulations. Let me show you how to get more now. How to get more on your own. You're gonna clean up your inquiries first. That's the first thing you're gonna do. Melon and love it. Right. The next thing you're going to do is when you walk into these banks, they like when you have relationships with them. Right. So you're going to walk into the bank and ask them, hey, can I open up a business checking account? That's number one. You're going to go to your credit unions first to do that. Once you open up your business checking account with them, um, they're going to try to trip you up. So what do you do for business? You better not tell them you do real estate. You better not tell them you do credit repair and you better not tell them you do business credit. Those are high risk industries. You don't want to tell them you do that stuff. Right. When I go get business credit, I was like, oh, I, I do business consultation, business management. Right. Because I help businesses start up. So I'm not lying. Right. But I'm, I just give them that information. Now they put my SIC code is not something that is um, is um, is high risk, because when you do a high risk business, that changes how much money they can possibly give you. So you want to be careful. Right. You don't want to get denied. and You want them to give you half the money. All right. Now, next up, after you open up the business checking account with them, hey, while I'm here. Let me get a business credit card. If your business is over two years old, you ask for a business credit card and a business line of credit. But if you're a fresh startup, ask for a business credit card. All right. My clients are doing this at credit unions first. Then they're going to like Bank of America, Wells Fargo. 
My clients are going to three to four banks on a Saturday. They're averaging twenty to forty thousand dollars on their own in business credit. Just doing that simple strategy. All right. How many inquiries is too many? If you have more than five or six inquiries in six months, that's too many inquiries. You can't be going back to back. After you get um, your business credit, right? Now, here's a little trick where my people go back and get more money. Here's what you do to get more money after you got some funding, right? Get the inquiries off. In the business credit world, inquiries is gold. It's gold. You don't have a bunch of inquiries. So clean them off and guess what? Run it back. Go to some new banks and get more business credit. You need help with getting your business um, inquiries? 609-832-3552. Call my office. We will set you up on how to get some inquiries off. $40 per inquiry, money back guarantee. I give you your money back if I don't get it done and I still finish the job. No one else is doing that. All right. And then you run it back and go get go get more business credit. OK, will they ask you for tax return? Ninety percent of the banks will not ask you for tax returns. This is a PG program, personal guarantor, and it's a no doc program. So when I walk into the banks, I tell them this. I was like, hey, how much money can you give me before you ask me for taxes? So like key bank, I think it's like fifty thousand dollars. So I can ask for up to fifty thousand dollars in credit and they will ask me for any documentation. Right. So, boom, you can do the same thing. Yeah, I only want forty five. I only want forty nine thousand. All right. And that's how you um, get some money. I purchased my S Corp about two weeks ago. How should I go about getting some business credit? If um, if you got 680 credit score, open up a business checking account and ask that bank for some money. Or you can call me six zero nine eight three two three five five two and we'll walk you through how to get some business credit. Should I open up some business account while working on credit? Yes, you can. You can open up business checking accounts while working on your credit. But if somebody's working on your credit, do not run your credit. Do not run your credit. Please, it's a pain in the butt. Don't do that. It actually hurts the process. All right? What else we got? Just throw them at me before Instagram kicks me off of here. Um, do they run your business profile with NAV? No, they do not. Because it's a business, um, you're personally guaranteeing it. But listen, we got to level up, right? Not all the time you guys are going to be personally guaranteeing business credit. We're going to get to the level where we're making millions of dollars. So you need to have Dun & Bradstreet. You need to have nab.com. Nab.com is the credit monitoring site for business credit. Okay, it's a credit monitoring site for business credit. So you wanna build up your personal credit history. Do you recommend reviving a six-year-old business? Absolutely, Dark Clowns. If, if they're not charging you a whole lot of money, revive it, revive it, wake that thing up. I just revived and I'm in Pennsylvania, so I didn't have to pay something crazy, maybe like a hundred bucks. I had an LLC that was 15 years old, guys. 15 years old. I woke it up. I brought it to my business credit guru, the guy who gave me game. I was like, how much money can I get with this? With my good credit, I have 800 credit. He was like, bro, you can get half a million dollars on the high end, low end, 300,000. So definitely it's worth it. My business number is 609. 832-3552. Listen, guys, my business is growing, right? So a lot of people call the line and it's my assistant or it's the vice president picking up the phone and be like, yeah, can I talk to Herman? I have trained them with everything I know. So ask them any question that you have. If they can't answer your question, just email me, info at bellasloanenterprises.com. You guys have been a blessing to me, so I can't talk to everybody that calls me. Just link in the bio if you need to make an appointment with me or if you want to get in touch with me real quick because you got a question info at bellasloanenterprises.com okay um uh, i just got my navy federal account what should i do with it put some money in it and open up a business checking account kansas um what's the best way to get an llc do them individually or establish under a corp the best way to get an llc is just to set it up simple don't make this complicated guys open up your llc get your ein and get your operating agreement okay can you get closed student loans off of my credit account my team and listen listen before you do research, before you sign, give your money to anybody. Do research on the person, all right? If you go to my highlights on my Instagram, it'll say results. I got results going back weeks. Nobody else is posting their results. You could go check my receipts, right? Check the receipt of the person you're working with. Success has history, so ask for receipts, all right? Success has history, ask for receipts. So you'll see the student loans that I've gotten off of my client's um, credit report. My team is amazing. The people that I, that I work with that, that do that for me. But as long as the account is closed, as long as it's closed, it can be disputed. How much do I charge for business funding? I don't charge anything for business card funding. Um, how are you getting funds off the cards? That's a secret. And I don't discuss that on Instagram. 
609-832-3552. That's the one thing I'm giving out for free. How to get the cash off the cards. Because I wait for, for class and I charge people for that information. But people need to get into the game because we are on lockdown. And I'm trying to give you as much information as possible. All right. Call me. 609-832-3552. Somebody just dropped the number right there. I'll tell you how to get it off. How much do I charge for business in a box program? That just depends. It ranges from what type of, um, how old the LLC is that you're buying, what, what, how much is the property. It's very reasonable. Okay. Um, email me if you want information on the bo business in a box program. That's where we give you a, a, a age LLC, get you funding, and we get you a property that's cash flowing from day one. No one else is doing that. Try to find them on Instagram. Um, can y'all remove Instagram that shows up on the business? Yes. So people who are getting business credit, they come right to me, get the inquiries off, and they run it back. The only inquiries we cannot get off are personal credit cards that you have actually have connected to an open account reporting to your credit report. report. So what we can get off is like car inquiries, business credit, um, utility bills, T-Mobiles, Comcast, those type of inquiries. We clean it up, okay? KeyBank gave you $30,000. Navy Fed is $50,000. Correct, uh, Melon Lover. You do your homework. You're on top of things. Don't worry about it. My, my guy, my guy Stacy Oliver from New York in the house. Um, do you need a lot of collateral? No, you do, you do not need a collateral. Your collateral is your good credit. Listen, guys, you know why I stress credit so much? Because it's the way to get into all this stuff that's moving and shaking right now. Because nobody has 30, 40, 50 sitting around. I don't have this money sitting around. So if you get your credit tight, then you're in the game. Let me show you the levels we, we at. You got to get your credit fixed. After you get your credit repair, you have to rebuild your credit. Some people need to rebuild it. Because some people I just cleaned up, they got like a 500 secure card, dollar secure card, but they want business credit. Nah, ain't happening, right? You have to build up your credit. Get some get some trade lines put on your credit, then get, apply for some personal credit cards. Get three, four, five thousand dollar limits. Use them, right? And then after six months, boom, we're going to get you some business credit. So this takes time, all right? What are some examples of high-risk businesses? Trucking, real estate, anything that has to do with guns, alcohol. If you want a list of high risk industries, I have a list of it. Info at bellasloanenterprises.com. Info at bellasloanenterprises.com. All right. How long should you wait to apply for business credit again once you have the, the gotten late payments removed? Immediately. All right. Once your credit is tight, let's get to it. Um, are you selling any business businesses with financials? No, I am not. Um, are you, how do you get your credit card limit increased automatically? You get your credit card limit increased automatically when you use your credit. When you use it often, they, they raise it automatically. Amex is really, really good for this. That's why I want everybody to apply for an Amex. If you have the opportunity, your credit is high. Even if they start you off at $2,000 limit, just get it. And Chase also, once you use the card and then you pay it back, they see the, the spend, they're going to give you automatic increase. But every four to six months, you guys are supposed to be calling them. Can I get a credit limit increase? Every four to six months, put it in your calendar. I have people who have a 10-year-old car, $2,000 limit. That's buffoonery. Stop being afraid of credit. We need to educate ourselves on that. Because the higher your credit limit, the older the car, the more valuable you are on paper to these banks. And they want to give you money. All right? Now, when you ask them for a credit limit increase, they're going to be like, well, how much do you want? Always ask for double. When you ask for double, right, 10% of the time, they'll be like, no. 90% they'd be like, well, no, nah, we're not. No, 10% they're going to say yes. 90% of the time they're going to be like, no. Nah. And then you tell them, well, what's the best you can do? So now your car went from 2000 to like 3500 or 4000 And every four to six months you do that. Okay? Um, I never recommend getting more than two trade lines. If somebody trying to sell you more than two trade lines, they're trying to steal your money. All right? That's thievery. It's not necessary. Okay? Now, after you fix your credit, you get trade lines. Stop using trade lines to cover shit. That's not how it works. Sorry for cursing, but that's ridiculous. Fix your credit first. Credit repair is taking a shower. Trade lines is deodorant perfume. Then you put that on. All right. I recommend getting trade lines at a five years old, $10,000 limit. That's a nice sweet spot. Link in my bio if you want the list of my trade lines. We help you with that too. How long do, um, does it take to get closed student loans account? I don't know. I don't know how long anything takes to get off. I do not work for the credit reporting agencies. I get this question a lot. How long is this going to take? How long is this going to take? We have no idea. We are your lawyers. That's how you have to think how credit repair people work. You are on trial for having bad credit. 
and I'm going to the jury and the judge, and I'm like, yo, you got to prove him wrong. You innocent until proven guilty. If you can't prove that this debt belongs to him, you have to take it off your credit report. That's how it works. So I don't know how long it takes. Sometimes it takes one month. Sometimes it takes two months. The other day, this client signed up with me, and like her, her score jumped up 100 points in like 45 days. I should have never posted that. I posted that. I've been with you for three, four months. Snapping on me. Everybody is different, okay? Um, and it all depends on who gets your letter. Nav.com, N-A-V. N-A-V.com is where you go to get your business credit report. You don't need to get that right now, okay? Because um, you don't have any credit and you got to pay $24 a month for that, all right? Um, is there a way I name my business... Is it a way to name my logistics business to get business credit? Um, yeah, that's just a good name. So here, here, here's a good naming system, guys. If you guys are afraid, can you help me with my LLC, Carmen 180? Um, you're gonna you're gonna DM Kevin J dot D O L C E, Kevin J dot D O L C E. He will help everybody on this live set up their LLC. And I'm gonna tell you another reason why that's super important. But to go back to the last question, naming your LLC shouldn't be rocket science. Keep it simple. Don't put financial, don't put investment, don't put real estate, don't put none of that. My businesses are named after my daughter. Olivia Monroe Enterprises, Bella Sloan Enterprises. My other LLC is called the Dulcie Group. Um, Bella Sloan Construction. You try not to make it so specific. Name it after yourself, name it after your children, slap enterprise on the end of it and call it a day and move forward. Don't make it too complicated, all right? Um, another reason why LLC is so important, you guys, I need you to pay, I need you to pay attention to this part. This is super, super important because this is what the other side knows and you don't know, right? LLCs are super important because it helps you save money on taxes. In Pennsylvania, LLC, to do it by yourself, go to YouTube University if you don't want to hire my brother. Um, LLCs uh, in Pennsylvania cost $125, right? You're able to write stuff off on your taxes now. So you're keeping more of the money that you have. Amazon didn't pay taxes last year. Um, federal taxes. G GE didn't pay taxes last year, and the president is not showing you his tax return because if you guys knew this stuff, you would think this is this is the devil's work. But you paying thirty percent in taxes. I don't pay thirty percent in taxes. I barely pay ten because I have that LLC. I write off my dinners, my dry cleaning. I write off this cell phone because I'm doing business on it right now. Everybody has a thousand dollar cell phone that's not making them any money. But when I ask them for a thousand dollars to fix their credit, they say I'm stealing from my people. No, I'm trying to give you gain. You get an LLC and you get good credit, you're getting $50,000 within 12 months. You're going to laugh at the thousand I charged you. We need to step it up and educate ourselves. So whenever people comment like that in my, in my, um, in my comments, I feel bad for them because they're not educated. So I'm trying to give you guys as much education as possible so you understand how this game works. All right. If you have an LLC, anybody here who has an LLC, right? I'll give you an example how credit repair and LLC can give you back money right now. If you have an LLC, you're going to go to T-Mobile, Verizon, Sprint, whoever, you're going to convert your personal cell phone bill. My my personal cell phone plan is about $400 a month, right? Because my whole family's on it, right? I got the LLC. I changed the cell phone bill from Herman name into my business name. Now, every month, I'm writing off the whole $400, right? So now I get to keep $400 of my money every single month times 12 months. You do the math just because I got that piece of paper. Everybody needs to go get that piece of paper. Every time I drive in my car... I use this app. It's called Trip Log. T R I P L O G. T R I P L O G. So when my car starts moving, right? I um it's a write off of 50 cents per mile when I'm doing any type of business. So everywhere I go is business. So I'm going to dinner with my team. That drive to the restaurant, business, right? When I get there the business, when I get there, we're literally finding over the check cuz we trying to figure out who's going to write off the check. If the check is $400, I'm taking a picture of that check, uploading it to trip log, so I get the tax return. I get the tax write-off. Get that piece of paper. It's super, super important. So change your cell phone bill into your business name so you can write off the entire bill, okay? Uh, quick tip right there. Keep up the gas, Armin. Runway billionaire, my dude. Um, how, how should we strategically apply for business credit cards? I know Chase has a 524 rule. I'm curious on how to go about applying for business. So... Now, think about it this way. Remember, Chase, you know Chase has that rule, right? So all you have to do is just work around it. First of all, you're not going to apply for Chase. Number two, my clients are going on a Saturday. They're applying to three to five banks. Open up a business checking account takes forever, guys. It's about 45 minutes to an hour. All right, it's not something sweet. But definitely do it that way. Open up a business checking account. Ask them for a business credit card. Do not tell them you're in high-risk industries. 
determine what is high risk industries, email me info at bellasoneenterprises.com. So you won't do that. They're going to three or four banks and doing it, right? They're getting the business credit. Then they, they get the inquiries by themselves off. Link in the bio. I have credit repair letters so you can fix your credit on your own if you don't want to hire me. Um, or you hire me, I get the inquiries off and they go right back. So inquiries don't matter if you're getting the inquiries off of your credit report. This only applies for business credit. Okay, keep the questions coming. Um, what program is it when you teach how to hide the LLC? So that program is coming um, real soon. I'm going to teach that at my um, Blueprint Summit, where it's a summit where just, we're just going to give you gains from soup to nuts on how to build this. We're literally going to give you a box, LLC, taxes, real estate, trucking. We're going to give you the game. This is not a summit where I'm going to upsell you a seminar, where I'm going to sell you a books and a one-on-one. -on -one. It's 37,000. I'm not giving you none of that stuff. You're going to tune in, sit in your living room, get your popcorn. I'm just going to give you game. All right. Um, and I'll show you how to structure your businesses because business credit is sexy and all that stuff. Right. But we got to structure your business. We got to set you up. So nobody's going to take this money from you once you get it. All right. So you want to hide all your LLC. So somebody's tripping and fall in front of one of your properties. Oh, Bella Sloan on that joint. Herman on Instagram. He looked like he got money. Sue him for everything he got. But now when you fall in front of my properties, you're not going to know who own it. Good luck to your lawyer because we hid that. My team is nice. All right. Um, best credit card, best checking accounts. Can't stand Wells Fargo. I can't stand Wells Fargo either. Either, But the best business accounts to go to, guys, are the ones in your community. The community credit unions. I'm telling you, they're giving away a bag, guys. If you get into Navy Federal, I wish I worked for Navy Federal because I get some stock in them. But Navy Federal, credit unions in your area. The best large bank, though, is Citizens. Citizens, they're, um, they're, checking, they're checking fees. They don't have any. If you put a penny in the account per month, there's no fees on it. How much for an LLC? That depends on what state you're in. All right. So Kevin J. Dot, D O L C E. Hit him up on Instagram. He'll tell you. An operating agreement is a piece of paper that says who owns the company, how you run the company, et cetera. So those are important documents to have when you're running your credit, when you're when you're building your business. LLC, EIN, an operating agreement. If you're gonna get that stuff, you want to get all three. There's some people that just give you an LLC. There's some people that just give you LLC and EIN. You want to get your LLC. EIN and your operating agreement. The operating agreement says how much percentage of the company is owned by who, who's on the board, all that stuff. It's a simple document, but it's important to have. Um, shout out to Tim from Brooklyn. I appreciate you too. There's a lot of banks that stopped doing funding. Most of mine is on the personal side. Yes, a lot of banks have stopped doing funding, but not all. So do not be discouraged, guys. There's a lot of banks out there. Um, they're still giving business credit. I post results all the time. It's still happening. Lines of credit has slowed down a lot, but business credit is still going on. And my team, a lot of my clients, I know, I know, listen, the news is scaring everybody. I'm not going to tell you that it's not real out here for a lot of people. That's why my team is giving back a little bit. We're not, you know, I'm not going to say like we're, we're saving a bunch of people. Like I'm giving away credit repair for free to somebody, an essential worker and gave away $500. My, uh, my guy from Self Tech, Greg Plazier, self.tech on Instagram. He's teaching people how to get a new um, skill where he teaches you how to test software for a living, right? Super sweet. Test software for a living, make eighty dollars to $100,000, right? And he just gave away some money to essential workers. So we're doing our best to give out, but you need to put yourself in position, guys, to help yourself out, all right? So don't be discouraged. There's many banks out there still giving out money. If you meet our 680 program, we'll definitely help you get some funding. I have $20,000 credit card that's a year old and a three-year-old credit card that's $750. Do you have to use the three-year-old card? Yes, they will look at the three-year-old card. But Edwin, way, right? Edwin, email me, info at bellasoneenterprises.com. I'm going to send you a little video of the plan B on how to get business credit with your situation because you don't meet my requirements, but I'm going to show you how to get business credit on your own, Okay. Um, the painting company, painting company is not high risk. Um, is there a way to my name, my business, uh, is there a way to name my logistics business to get business credit card? I'm not sure I understand that question, Mr. Sherry, um, Cherry. Um, how do I get Navy Federal when you don't have a relative on the military? You have to finesse your way. You got to find somebody who got it, Put go on, go on Instagram, go on, um, oh, what's that website? Craigslist. And put it, put an ad up. Hey, I'm looking for somebody to get me into Navy Federal. I, I give you a hundred bucks, and they'll use their code to get you in there. You got to be savvy to get in there. LLC cost depends on what state you're in for collections that are paid for. Can you get them off as well? Yes. Um, with 
with from NYC or well, I don't want to butcher your name, but yes, we can get collections off of your credit repair. We like to do a free credit assessment. I don't take any money from anybody unless I do an assessment of your credit. So literally I do a video and I'm going through your, your, um, your credit report on the screen and I'm talking to you. Here's the good, here's the bad, here's the ugly, here's what I can do to help you give you game. And then I email it back to you. If you want to sign up for services, you, um, then we take it. But my credit repair minimum started at thousand dollars. All right. Um, I called and I'm waiting for the team to return. If you called and no one picked up, email me info at Bella Sloan Enterprises dot com. Um, we are super swamped, but we, we we apologize for that. But if you can't get in touch with us at 609-832-3552, email us or DM me. I always respond to my DMs and email me. Went to his class. It's the truth. Thank you so much. With um, how do you get off open car loan inquiries? How? Uh, my gift. <laughs> uh, no, I just I just dispute it. I write the dispute letters or I call and I dispute it. Um, but, you know, we'll get those off for you. Um, Forty dollars per inquiry. Money back guarantee. My email info at Bella Sloan Enterprises dot com. All right. Why? Um, uh, my number is six zero nine eight three two three five five two. That's the business line. You will not get me directly. Um, cause right now I had to hand the phone over to my, to my team to, to handle the calls cause I'm grinding and working. I'm building something special for you guys. I'm really working really hard on this business summit on this, on this blueprint summit where <clears throat> just imagine having a live for four hours and I'm breaking everything down for you and I'm going to email everybody out some documents, credit repair letters. I'm going to give those out for free inquiries, bankruptcy removes, all that stuff. I'm going to show you how to do that on your own. How many trade lines should I get on my personal credit? No more than two. Five years old, $10,000 limit, depending on how old you are, okay? Um, can I have a personal Zoom call with you? Yes, you can have a personal Zoom call with me. Link in the bio. There's a link for that. Book my time. I got you. Um, if you want to if you wanna book an appointment with me. Um, um, what's a low-risk industry? Anything that's not on the high-risk industry. So if you want a list of the high-risk industry, um, info at bellasloanenterprises.com, Okay. Uh, let's see. Cannibals, anything with drugs is a high risk industry. So change your name and say you do something else. Because once you get the business credit, fund whatever you want to do. Do with the money what you want to do with the money. MX has amazing benefits. MX is how I travel for free, guys. That's how I travel for free. You see me go everywhere. I'm, all, I'm everywhere traveling for free, plane tickets. MX is how I travel for free because I use my business lines, right? I swipe, 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 buy real estate, do whatever I need to do, take the cash off the cards, and then I get these points and I use those points to buy plane tickets. Should I go buy my FICO score or Credit Karma? I got a personal Amex and a Discover. You go buy your FICO score, Experian.com. All right. I like Credit Karma because it updates every week. It's free. It tells me if there's anything negative. But the scores, you have to follow Experian.com. Okay. Um, they always say you do it through the automated system. Um, only two lines. Shout out to iHeartCredit, man. She really giving game in, in the messages. My number, 609-832-3552. You will speak to my team, not to me directly. They will answer any questions that you have. You like it when I curse. <laughs> Cut it out. I try not to curse, man. My past on here. Um, let's see what else we got on here. Drop the question. Drop the question. Nav.com. Let's see. I never know how long it's going to take to remove anything. Let's see what we have here. How much do I charge for personal and business funding? I don't charge for funding at all. You got 10 LLCs? Go ahead, bro. Um, let's see. I need your eight. You need an age LLC. Info at bellasoneenterprises.com. That comes with our business in a box program. We don't just sell age LLC, business with a box program. I'm testing out my primary trade line program. That's going to be epic, guys. When I drop that, that's going to be epic. Imagine a two year old credit card, $10,000 limit on your credit report. We can make it a credit card. We can make it a, a loan. We can make it a mo It's going to be epic. Wait till I drop that. Can you repeat the info for the phone again? Info. Uh, my phone. Okay. Oh, for the phone. So um, this is how you write off your entire phone bill. Get an LLC. If you got your LLC, then call up your um, cell phone company or walk in and tell them, hey, um, I want to switch over from my name to my business name. Once they switch it over, now you can write off the whole bill. All right. Keep your money. Stop giving it to the government. Keep your money. Um, how bad do open student loans not close impact your credit score? It doesn't hurt your credit score. The only thing that hurts your credit score is maxing out your cards, right? And um, late payments. Herman is the truth. He got me business credit. Process was clean and professional. I appreciate you, the motivator, 1975. Listen, if you ever have any bad complaints about me, email me. I'll fix it. 
I'm a small black business owner. I, I need to learn some things. If I'm not doing it right, I'll do it right. Info at BellaSloanEnterprises.com. That is my email. Can you put your car in your business name as well? Hell yeah. You can put your car in your business name. That's a crazy finesse. Or you can have your business co-sign for the car, right? And it's not on your credit report. Um, here's another here's another game, guys. I know, I know on Instagram and on TV, everybody makes it look good. Yo, I bought my car cash. I own this. It's not a lease. That's clown shit. All right? When you have a lease, this is my opinion. You don't need to take my advice. You could write off the whole car if you have a business. So imagine you have a Porsche for $1,000. If you have um, a Toyota Camry, whatever, the note is $200 to $1,000, and you could write off the whole thing because you leased the car. When you own the car, you can only write off some of it. But when you lease it, you can write off potentially own the, the whole thing. And I don't know if you guys follow some guy named Credit on Instagram. It's, it's an it's a Asian gentleman, right? Credit. Literally, his name is Credit on Instagram. There's a reason why he puts his logo on his car because now his car is a, is, a, is a walking billboard. So now the whole car is a write-off. Come on, guys. Get the LLC, man. The game is crazy out here. The seminar is going to be this summer. I'm not sure exact date. I'm going to drop it soon. Um, CPA recommend recommendation. I am going to give you that. I'm going to give you my guy. My guy, um, he is so good. I only paid, I'm going to tell you how much I paid in taxes. I only paid 15000 in taxes last year. I'm not going to tell you how much I made because y'all be drawing. But he's amazing and he does it legally and he's nice. And I'm going to give you his phone number if you guys haven't done your taxes yet. Now, my tax professional is part of my team now. I talk to him every 60 days. I tell him how much I made. I start paying my taxes early. His name is Steve. His name is Steve. His phone number is 267-784-5040. Steve, my tax guy, tell him Herman sent you 267-784-5040. Okay? That's Steve, my tax guy. He's going he's gonna to take care of you. I promise you. All right? Um, and, of course, I don't have his number. Hold on, guys. And you're not showing up. Oh, guys, I want to give you another number because I see y'all asking for the LLC guy a lot. Uh, get my notes app out. I apologize, guys. I should have been prepared. All right. The LLC phone number, 609-288-2623. If you need an LLC, 609-288-2623. Two six two three. That's to get your LLC. What's the Trip app again? It's called Trip Log. I love that app because again, the moment my car moves, it keeps track of everything. So at the end of the year, it'd be like, oh, you drove ten thousand miles. That's seven thousand dollars in tax savings. I just press a button and email it to my guy Steve. So boom, that's seven thousand dollars I get to keep in my pocket. Less taxes I pay to the government. What? Um, do, how do you change the address on your operating agreement? Um, Secretary of State. Um, you got, anytime you change your business name, your business address, your business phone number, everything that has to do with your business, you got to let the government know. So tell the Secretary of State how to do that, okay? How many LLCs do I have? I have a lot. I have a lot. And you guys should have a lot too, okay? Every two to three months, I get a new LLC. Why? Because I tell people all the time, I'm not leaving my kids no money. I'm going to leave them businesses and business credit because for 20, 30, 40 years, they watch their dad flip money. I'm going to hand them a skill and be like, go ahead. Now you do it because I want them to show them how to do it. So I'm so every LLC I get, I put it on the shelf. Sometimes I start using it immediately, but then it's a new business that I got to do business credit with. So definitely get some while you are live. It's the worst. Um, Triplog.com. What is the name of the software tester? The software tester. Um, this is a great skill and trade to have, all right? I did this years and years ago. Self-tech, S-E-L-F dot tech, T-E-C-H. His name is on Instagram. He's training people within four to six months on how to become a software tester. His clients, go to his page. You're going to see the results. They're eighty to $100,000. It was great about software testers right now. They're working from home. You see what Google is doing right now. Google and Facebook said they don't have to work. They don't have to go to work till next year. So you can work from home because all you need is an internet and a laptop. Can I repeat my the phone number? 60. My um brother's phone number for the LLC. 
609-288-2623. Go get your LLC. Go get your LLC and go change your business, your um your phone to your um your business name. Right there, I just made everybody probably three or four thousand dollars just by just by that information. When do you need an operating agreement agreement if you are a sole proprietary business? No, you do not. But if you are a sole prop, change it to an LLC. You want to remove the liability from yourself. All right. Businesses are supposed to protect you and your assets. All right. So change it to an LLC. All right. Um, I want to learn new credit repair tips. How much do you charge? Um, I'm starting up that class right now. Okay. Uh, I'm not starting right now, but I will be teaching everybody the credit game on how it's done. And then, and then we move it from there. Oh, Oh, okay. Um, Oliver Legacy. Y'all see that? Oliver Legacy. My guy, my guy, Stacy Oliver. He's willing to help people get into Navy Fed. If you're willing to help people get into Navy Fed, put it in the comments. You, they're going to charge you $100. Let's get, let's get some money. Everybody get some money in here. There you go. I love that. All right. DM, if you, if you got Navy Fed and you trying to help somebody get into Navy Fed, $100. Let's get some game. I love it. Citizens Bank is a good bank, all right? Damn, y'all really have a lot of questions today. I promise I'm going to do better on going on live, guys. I promise. 240 people is a lot of questions. Uh, let's see. Let me scroll down. Any credit union, TG.1. TG Any credit union is a great credit union to get business credit. A cleaning company is a good company to get business credit. I used to have a cleaning company back in the day, guys. I used to clean toilets for real, for real. That was a great hard hustle term me a lot. Taught me a lot, all right? Um, Herman, what's the lowest credit score you need to get an Amex goal? 680. 680 credit score. Get you into the door for business credit, okay? I have eight corps and an LLC. Nice. Nice. Uh, let's see. What else we got here? Um, lease is everything. Lease is everything. Oh, God, I'm way back in these questions. I talked about lease a while ago. Um, how do you get the name on the LLC not to show publicly? Um, that's a, that's coming. I, I got to show y'all how to do that. My man, Rika States doing big things in Philly right now with real estate. Shout out to him. Shout out to Rika States. Go follow him, guys. I'm serious. Go follow him. Go follow Self Tech. Um, Self dot tech. Um, so you mean to tell me I can write off this car lease if you have an LLC? If you have an LLC, you can write off the car. And then slap a bumper sticker on your car that has your business name on it. Walking billboard. If you don't believe me, ask your tax professional. All right? Because I'm doing it. I'm keeping all this money as much as I can get. Every two, three months, get an LLC. I do. That's, I'm just telling y'all what I do. I'm giving y'all the game that I do, okay? Um, when should a person get a trade line if you have an LLC? Um, if you have a trade line, when should you get an LLC? So if you have an LLC and your credit is good, then you go get a trade line and then you build your credit with some personal credit. Then you get a um, then you get a, a, a business credit cards. All right. Self dot tech. Thank you for putting that attorney recommendations. No, I can't give you any attorney recommendations. Um, oh, you know, a good place to go get attorneys. Real talk, guys. Um, I know everybody used to think they're scammers, but they're totally legit. Um, hey, what's up, Joe? Um Oh my God, I'm having a brain fart. Um, the lawyers that prepaid legal. There you go. That's like thirty dollars a month, and you have a lawyer. I said, I, um, they're they're really really good. Um, let me see, let me see, let me see. DM me. You guys really on that Navy Federal? <laughs> that is hilarious. Um, the live game is great. Thank you so much, guys. Should people get trade lines? Should, people should get trade lines. Motivate me, D. People should get trade lines when they fix their credit. After your credit is repaired, then you get it, okay? Um, living in New York, in LLC, Cleveland, what credit union? I don't know what credit unions are in New York or Cleveland. You just have to Google it. Google credit unions in your zip code, right? And all of them will pop up. Call each of them. Hey, do you do business credit? Yeah. You taking appointments? Yeah. I'll be there on Saturday. Open up a business checking account. Don't tell them you in a high-risk industry. Tell them mind their business. I do business consultation, all right? Yeah, this live is gonna stay up for twenty four hours, guys. I don't, I don't remove them. Um, Legal Shield, also, yes, Legal Shield. Thank you, Stacy. I appreciate you. 
Um, do trade lines report to all three credit reports? Yes. The ones I have. Link in my bio. If you listen, in my bio, you can book an appointment with me. In my bio, you can do a Zoom phone call with me. In my bio, credit repair letters. If you don't want to do it, hire me. You can get them yourself. In my bio, link in my bio um, is my book, business credit book. All that information you need about anything I'm talking, most likely in my bio, okay? Save this live. I got like five minutes. Thank you. I got like five minutes. I'm going to end it early because I don't want them to cut me off. Yes, Philadelphia Federal Credit Union. My, my mans, he just got $20,000 from them. And he went in on their own and he got it. All right? So credit union. So listen, I got like three minutes. So let's let's do rapid fire. All right? Self-tech, S-E-S-E-L-F dot T-E-C-T. T-E-C-H, excuse me, self-tech. They'll teach you a trade on how to do business credit. All right? Link in my bio to make appointment with, make an appointment with me or my team will call you. If you have any questions that I wasn't able to answer, there's 250 people on this live right now. There's no way I'm going to be able to call everybody, but just email me. Info at bellasloanenterprises.com. All right? And I'll be able to help. So listen, mentorships is coming out. Bella Sloan Enterprises Academy is coming out because I want to be able to give people information instead of just on a live or whenever I do a class. I got to give you the information as soon as possible. So I'm working on all that behind the scenes and give you something super, super professional. No more than $400 for this class and it'll just be up there forever. My, um, my Blueprint Summit where I'm going to be teaching everybody as much game as possible that's coming out this summer. It's going to be epic. Temple canceled me because coronavirus, but it is what it is. But I appreciate you guys. Thank you so much. DM me if you have any questions. Link in the bio if you want any information about Bella Stone. If you want us to help me, if you want me to help you fix your credit, help you get business credit, I am here to serve you. I am here to help you. God bless. Jesus saves. All right. God bless you, you guys. We're going to get through this. We're going to be fine. Just prepare yourself. No one is going to save you. Everybody put yourself in position. So we're going to win. All right. I'm going to go live again next week because there's a lot of people on here and I don't want to disappoint anybody um, if I wasn't able to answer your questions. All right. Thank you very much. I love you all. God bless. Peace.